Hey everybody, it's Jason Blaha here, and I saw Paul Carter, who uh, writes for Lift Run Bang, who you guys may or may not be aware of. I actually read his blog. I saw him post on his Facebook page last night that he wrote probably the most politically incorrect and very popular, the most unpopular article he would ever write for his blog, and he was torn about publishing it, but he decided he was going to publish it this morning anyways. Well, I went ahead and read it, and I'm going to link it down below, and I, I thought it was really interesting because it's something I caught a lot of flack for addressing, and he took it two steps further than I even dared to in a YouTube video. He pretty much went all out, and he completely attacked not necessarily just Ashley Graham for being on Sports Illustrated, but the whole message it sends to society and even Sports Illustrated for their tactics behind doing it for sensationalism and to make money. But he has some interesting messages in it. And uh, I want to state up front, if you're politically correct or have any sense of entitlement or you're easily offended, don't read his article. It's going to offend you if you fall under any of those categories. Just absolutely do not read it. But I do want to quote something at the very end of the article that I think sums it up, and I agree with Paul here, just so you guys get an idea of where he goes in this blog. And he wrote, and I quote, I won't make a difference in the fucking world. I'm just writing on a blog, but I won't teach my kids that they deserve participation trophies or that they are entitled to a goddamn thing, and that the only things you deserve are those you work to earn, keep, and hold on to. Fuck your entitlement and fuck your body positivity bullshit. Fuck propping up on your millennial heroes and their mediocrity. And I think that kind of sums up pretty much what Paul wrote in this very long detailed article. It is very much a bit of a rant, but for those of you who understood what I was trying to say in my own video on this topic, you will very much enjoy this. So go check out Paul's blog. And this is also kind of a shout out for Paul Carter because I don't mention him often enough. I don't like everything he does or things I dislike about what he does, such as selling supplements, but his overall training philosophy and message for people who are have very serious goals or serious competitive goals is actually uh, worth looking into. So I hope it's been informative and I will talk to you guys next time.